Well, it's one of the council's first electric cars, which has been fantastic to drive, it's fantastic for carbon emissions, and it actually helps the council save money. Um, the council's now got three electric smart cars, um, uses pool vehicles, and I'm lucky enough to be one of the people who can use one of the first ones. Well, the car has a range of about 80 miles, so for most times around Birmingham, it's actually no problem at all. But as you can see, you can just plug it in and charge it on the street. Um, also, we can plug it in and charge it up at home. Or we have, in, in the office where we're based, we have a number of charging points there, and it's charged up overnight. I mean, a full charge, which would let you do 80 miles, takes about seven and a half, eight hours. But uh, at the moment, it's done about 80% charge, so uh, that still gives me a range of 60 miles, which is good enough for most journeys in Birmingham. Oh, well, it's, it's primarily, obviously, used for work. Um, so if we need to go to a neighbourhood office and it's difficult to get there by public transport or it's too far to walk or cycling is an option, it's perfect. It helps us get there quickly um, and gets us out into the, the suburbs of the city um, to attend meetings, to meet with residents, to meet with councillors um, in a quick and efficient and environmentally friendly way. I think these electric vehicles actually don't just hit a green agenda, they actually help the council in many ways. Um, obviously at the moment, with severe financial constraints on the council, it actually helps save money. I mean, the running costs for the car are about, you know, you're talking about 10, 10, 12p a mile, so it's much, much cheaper to use this, even though the initial outlay is more expensive, but it's actually cheaper in running costs than using a conventional vehicle, which is one of the main reasons we've got the vehicle. Also, it helps in terms of air quality. Um, however efficient your petrol or diesel vehicle is, you still produce uh, various particulates and, and and pollution for the city centre, so it really helps on air quality and of course on carbon. It's, if you're charging it with, with um, renewable energy, it's zero carbon. Um, so they meet in many ways, but probably the big reason for Birmingham being involved in this is Birmingham is famous for being the city of the car. So that's where our business is, that's where our technology, that's where our, our manufacturing is based on. So actually to be in the forefront of the low carbon vehicle revolution, to try and make sure these vehicles, this one unfortunately is made in Germany, but some of the battery technology and other technologies are from the West Midlands. So how can we help kickstart the, the electric vehicle revolution and that Birmingham can get some of the economic benefits and the jobs? And that's probably the really key reason for being involved in electric vehicles.